It's a pretty uneventful afternoon so far, but I tell you what, I've been drinking like crazy today. Tomorrow, I turn 21 years old. Generally recognized within society as like a, a big birthday for reasons I'm sure you're aware of. Um, don't necessarily see it the same way. Looking forward to what is, in my mind, really just another day in my life tomorrow. Uh, today has been good. This weekend's been pretty good so far. Started off some of my, my birthday weekend since today's Sunday, tomorrow's Monday. Friday night, Samantha and I went to see uh, a musical production of the movie Frozen by some youth. Fantastic. Well done. I enjoy musicals. I do. Um, I also got a birthday present from my parents in the mail. A box of these. <laughs> I feel like Benny Rodriguez. Huge Sandlot fan growing up. I mean, what kid growing up watching Sandlot doesn't want a pair of PF flyers. I immediately feel like I can run faster and jump higher just holding these. I've thrown around like a long time in my mind whether I should um, buy myself a pair of these, but my parents are like, oh, what do you want for your birthday? And I've been considering getting a pair of shoes like these actually for, for not only like the cool nostalgic childhood purpose, but for a functional purpose as well, because they're some of a flat sole, which is good for deadlifting, and I've needed a pair of shoes that are potentially good deadlift shoes, so um, that's what these will be used for. As well as if I'm ever playing baseball with the boys, hit a ball over the fence, need to, you know, go rescue the, the ball from a large dog, something like that. I feel like Benny the Jet. Man, I'm about ready to go pickle the beast. Let's go. And by pickle the beast, I mean smash some heavy deadlifts with these things on. I think these feel really good. These can be the new deadlift shoes. Solid gift. Thanks, Mom and Dad. And it's been somewhat of a relaxing week, and I haven't had a ton of um, school stuff to do, so I've been able to chill a little more, which has been very nice. Now this evening, I have uh, two meetings and mass on campus. That's gonna that's gonna round out a day, leading into my, my final day as a 20-year-old. The way this night has gone, my meeting ended up going pretty long, came back, still had to eat, and I wasn't intending to stay up this late, but it is currently just after midnight, which means it's technically Monday, October 28th, which means I am technically 21 years old, so I figured, why not? Might as well have a drink before bed. <sighs> Hydration before bedtime. Very important. Although, it was a pretty late night last night, not an ideal amount of sleep. We don't miss a Monday morning. Gotta get that Monday morning cardio in to start the week off right. As they say, can't drink water all day if you don't start in the morning. Rest of the morning, we'll be eating breakfast, which will just be the very standard eggs, oatmeal, and water. Um, then go spend some time in the chapel, start my day in prayer, and then spend a few hours at work this morning before heading back to the gym to get my workout in today. And I'm excited for it today because we'll be hitting deadlifts, and particularly with the new shoes that I mentioned earlier in the video. And I'm excited because this is my first like, legit deadlift session. I, I, I brought the, the shoes to the gym with me on Saturday for my leg workout just to kind of mess around and very, very light deadlifts to see how they feel. Felt really good. So hopefully I can do something actually heavy today. I haven't lifted heavy deadlifts in a while, like anything over four plates. So um, we'll see what we do today and uh, how these shoes make me run faster, jump higher, and lift heavier. Well, never mind because about five minutes after I recorded that clip, both the men's baseball team and the women's soccer team swarmed into the weight room at the same time. Like it's annoying when there's one sports team in there, but when two come in, like 
there's an obscene amount of people in there. I was like halfway through my deadlift warm up and like if I was feeling really good, I would have just stayed and honestly would have just like done my thing and they would just have to deal with it. But I was feeling like iffy or average enough to just say, whatever, this, I won't deal with this right now. I'll just come back later, get a solid lift later tonight. Well, I don't really know what to do with myself for the rest of the afternoon now. I'm currently eating yogurt with berries, cereal, and a little bit of protein powder. Uh, enjoy yogurt. I, I'm a big fan. I don't really have classes or hardly any responsibilities for the rest of the day. Uh, probably spend the time maybe working on some homework, maybe working on some video editing. Probably what I have from this video so far. Why do people not like yogurt? <coughs> yogurt is very good like forget that it's not going in the vlog but overall it'll probably be a just a chill afternoon evening i have one group i could potentially go to tonight and um, we'll see when i can get to the gym i have to check when other teams are coming in anyways i like yogurt <laughs> highly uneventful afternoon did spend a fair amount of it editing this video which was nice but also spent some time kind of just chilling which is also kind of nice. It's a pretty uneventful afternoon so far, but I tell you what, I've been drinking like crazy today. Gotta stay hydrated, man. Easily about a gallon of water so far today. I'm peeing like a racehorse. You know, trying to infuse healthy habits, keeping the body running smoothly on the 21st birthday. Isn't that what it's all about? Enough of these games, enough of this chit chat. It's time to go lift. It's been far too long since I've done heavy deadlifts. Possibly a, a month and a half to two months since I've even put like four plates in the bar. So this feels heavy today when it really shouldn't. And uh, doing a three by three with 405 should not be that much, but that's what we're doing today. I can at least look at this and know that I can do a lot more, but this gives me at least a baseline to continue moving forward in the next few weeks so I'm more intentional with my training, especially for squat, bench, and deadlift. I'll talk about that more in the next video. Time to get my third set. When I recorded that one clip of me doing deadlifts, my camera started at like 25% battery. When I ended the clip, like the 45 second clip of me doing deadlifts, my camera was at zero. Kind of grinds my gears, but uh, it's okay. Just means didn't get any other lifting footage. I promise I still lift weights. Maybe I will record my lifts from tomorrow morning. <laughs> Either way, it's uh, almost eight o'clock now. Um, I'm not doing anything else for the rest of the night. I'm gonna have some ice cream to celebrate this joyous occasion of my birthday. And to some extent, this is a kind of like sweet treat, like a cheat meal type thing, but I'm fitting this into my macros as well because it's slow churned like half the fat ice cream. You know, I've been thinking about this throughout the day. I feel like so many people on their birthday just feel like you're entitled to this just outpouring of love and appreciation and affirmation and attention from everyone because it's your birthday. You're entitled to this extravagant like birth, feeling like a king for a day. Let me tell you, the world does not stop turning just because it's your birthday. Life goes on. It's just another day for me. just before nine o'clock I'm going to bed. I'm legitimately pretty tired, so I'm just, I got nothing else to do tonight. What are most people doing on their 21st birthday at nine o'clock? Probably not going to bed. See you in the morning. <laughs> so allow me to address the things that you are probably thinking about at this point in the video, kind of in two parts. The first of which is, uh, do you have any fun? Most people on their birthdays do at least like something. Right? What I will say is that I have set up my life in a way, and I think everyone should have their life set up that you are able to spend your time and energy doing things that fulfill you and that give you purpose and that give you joy. A day that I get to spend, you know, spending some time in prayer, having a great workout, eating good food, like eating food that makes me both feel good and then being able to enjoy stuff, like I ate some ice cream. Like you don't have to go crazy, but it was a good, fulfilling day. That's all I ask for. 
And like I said, I, just because it's like my my special day doesn't mean it has to be necessarily over the top, extravagant, different than any other day. It was a good day. And the second thing that I'm sure you're wondering about uh, the drinking. Here's the thing. I uh, am choosing not to drink alcohol, um, neither on my 21st birthday nor moving forward. I have no plans or intentions to do so. I'm going to be recording today a video giving exactly why I'm making that choice. It'll be up on my other YouTube channel, Faith Lifestyle Movement, tomorrow, the day after I upload this video. So be on the lookout for that once it's up. I'll post a link in the description in the comments below. But in short, one piece of it, one thing I want to at least leave you with for this video is, hear me loud and clear, you do not have to drink alcohol on your 21st birthday. Because when someone says to you, 21st birthday, probably the first thing that comes to your mind is drinking alcohol. It almost seems like there's this unwritten rule that like your 21st birthday, everyone drink, like it's just this understood thing within society that on your 21st birthday, the thing that you do is you have a drink or two or one or three or four or five too many. And I don't want any single day of my life to be essentially focused on or attached to or controlled by any kind of substance. So now I'm 21, feel super old. That's it for the video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, thumbs up, um, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. I'll see you in the next one. Also be on the lookout for that other video that I'll post on my other channel. Thanks, see ya, bye.